Earlier in September, the announcement was made that the National Finals Rodeo was moving to Texas and would be at the Globe Life Field in Arlington. This decision was made after the PRCA sent out a survey asking fans where they would like it to be held and asking if they would attend in person. This event is usually held in Las Vegas. Vegas, there was going to be not a chance for any fans to be at the venue this year. While the contract is only for this year, officials are hopeful that event organizers can see a prosperous future in the Lone Star State. Right now, they're only saying that they're going to be selling around 15,000 tickets. It's a venue of 40,000, 30 to 40,000 people that they can put in that uh, stadium. but. You know, if things open up, they're going to open up more and more tickets. This event and the events that accompany it are expected to bring in millions to the Texas economy. I think it's going to be great for the state of Texas. It's going to be great for fans. All over the United States, numbers from ticket sales, attendance of performances that weren't canceled, and viewership on streaming platforms and television show an increase in views and interest in rodeo. Several factors could contribute to the spike in curiosity and viewers. People are a little bit tired of all the politics in the other sports, maybe the NBA, the NFL. Um, you know, one thing about the great sport of rodeo is nobody's going to kneel during the national anthem. And I think that that has a lot to say of, of, of the sport that we have. The 2020 NFR will take place December 3rd through the 12th. For Contra Valley Homepage, I'm Sonora Scott.